When a divorce happens, you don't just lose the person that you were married to. You're going to likely lose much more. And often that includes restructuring your friends and your family and that supportive network and your social community. So rebuilding community and friendship after your world is collapsing due to divorce is really overwhelming and frustrating. The people you relied on may no longer be there. And if they are, it might feel awkward. Places you felt safe in your community, you might no longer feel safe. Which is why sometimes it's easier to walk away and let friendships come to an end when you're going through divorce, though we don't want you to have to do that. Although you might feel like the hole inside of you is growing as you lose relationships through the divorce process. The fear of losing your friends when you decide that getting divorced is a real fear. And one that sometimes we don't think about as we're navigating the divorce and trying to rebuild our lives. But what I've learned, any major change or transition in our lives comes with loss. We lose friends, aspects, of ourself and a community we once relied on. So let me be transparent here. You will likely lose some people that you called friends and families when you were going through a divorce, regardless of how long you've been in each other's lives or what you've been through together. Not everyone is going to stay. It's sad. You will absolutely mourn the loss of these relationships and ones that remain will probably transform into what type of relationship? Well, only time will tell. However, I do know this. You're going to be okay. If not today, eventually. Building new friendships and communities like healing takes time and it happens in layers. It happens in steps. 